Hello, everybody. Santa Prince guy. <clears throat> Hello, YouTubers. <laughs> no, that's uh, the other person's, uh, you know, introduction. Like, here's Johnny. My my introduction is, hello, Google Plus YouTube people. Watchers, DOTs, hello. Hello, world. <laughs> okay, I'm extremely exhausted, everybody, right? No. I, you know, I'm tired. tired. Okay. <clears throat> but we're going to finish Corinthians right now. That's what we're going to do. And it's, uh, a lot of it's good, you know. So I'm, you know, I was thinking about reading the whole thing because it's pretty good. Except the boasting part, I don't like, you know, like that too much. All right, well, I'm just going to, you know, go through the juicy tidbits here. Okay, 11.4, you happily put up with whatever anyone tells you, even if they preach a different Jesus than the one we preach. Or, okay. Oh yeah, okay, now I know why I want to, okay, now I remember what I want to say, okay. You happily put up with whatever anyone tells you, even if they preach a different Jesus than the one we preach. Okay, y'all, a different Jesus than the one we preach. Well, it seems to me, in Spanish, you don't say Jesus, you say Jesus. And it seems to me that as Apollo is in here, uh then <clears throat> don't you think that Zeus would be you know around the area there <laughs> you know it's always been Zeus and Apollo I mean <laughs> Sally has says about Apollo in there okay hey Zeus you know don't you think that Hollywood could have said you know know that secret you know, hey Zeus means hey Zeus, like the god Zeus. So they said, that's how they made Abbott and Costello. Hey Abbott. That's how he did that instead of hey Zeus. All right, so that's, you know, Hollywood arrogance, man. That's what I'm talking about, man. That's a perfect example, man. It's straight up arrogance. It's straight up. Uh, <laughs> uh, man, the arrogance boy, yo. I still give them props though. The the produce Hollywood producers, the fucking guys are fucking geniuses, man. How they worked all the history in there and the symbolism, and fucking amazing. They're amazing, really are. <clears throat> But the only people that really see how amazing they are is is someone that has opened their spiritual sight and can see all the even if you know, even if you're not totally aware of your true history, uh you could you know, you then you start to see the symbolism, you know, thanks to people like Truth Aggregated and Manny and you know, a lot of people, you know, that reveal the little details that started us to see, you know. <clears throat> It's so this it's so despicable to me that on the new era all the news is fabricated, and that these people actually go to jail to play out the news stories. That's why I get special privileges in there. <clears throat> and uh, it's just they go to jail to play out the news stories. People actually do that, you know. Serious. That's that is that's crazy, man. That's yeah, that's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. It really is. I mean, we go to jail because we're just the slaves, and they're you know they're they're you know on the other side of the tracks. There, we're just the slave people. But uh, yeah, okay. So I'm getting off track here. Okay, I'm tired, man. Let me focus here. Okay, um, okay. Different Jesus. All right. Okay, I already said that. All right. <clears throat> okay, different Jesus than the one we preach, or a different kind of spirit than the one you received. Okay, a different kind of spirit than the one you received. Okay, they could be talking about the host. You're receiving the 
bears Jehovah when you take the host. That's that's the spirit you're receiving. All right. <clears throat> but if you're in accordance with with the you know one eighty two hierarchy, then <clears throat> if that's even the actual number, I'm not even. I don't. It's probably not even the real number. They're not gonna put the real number out there like that. I, that's probably like some seriously guarded, you know, uh, or not. Maybe not, but you know, like I thought it could be Cyrus. It could actually be two eighty two because Cyrus wrote two hundred eighty two laws. But I don't know if that's the case. It doesn't really matter. Like when you know, you connect your source, then you just connect. It's, I don't know. It's kind of like. You know, you want to wake up at a certain time in the morning. Like me, if I if I have to get up at a certain time, I don't need a alarm clock. I'll just wake up exactly at that time. I know I have to get up at that time and just wake up. I do that. I do that all the time. You know, unless I'm, unless of course you're like all bombed up and fucking fucked up, and then you know, stayed up for two days. No, you can't do it like that. Well, you fair and stay, you good, you know, everything's all right. You go to sleep and say, I got to get up. And you wake up. I wake up every time. Guaranteed. Okay, I don't know what the hell that has to do with anything. Okay, I'm getting off the track here. Okay, different spirit. Yeah, explain that. Now, don't forget, um, they talk about familiar spirit. I don't even, tell you the truth, I don't really understand what the, what the people talk about familiar spirit. I don't know what... I don't know if that's the virus, the that familiar spirit they're talking about, or familiar spirit. I don't know if you, anybody ever saw the story about the witches that went to the Benny Hinn thing, and uh, they were trying to curse the Benny Hinn guy, and and he knew they were there, and the and the, and the well, they said they were Satanist people, and they went there and they <clears throat> Satanist witches, though they said, and they were trying to curse the guy, and he knew they were there. You know they're there, and he said, and he, 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 the girl said that Benny Hinn stopped the what he was doing. He said, "I know there's some witches out there, and they're trying to curse me right now." And, you know, yeah. So why are you trying to do this to me? I mean, what I do to you, or whatever. You know, why you, you know, why are you persecuting me or something? He said. And then, and then the girl who was the witch, the Satanist witch lady, said she claimed to be, uh, said that she could see angels, but. They couldn't. They can only see him from the uh, from a certain point, head up, just like part. Because they said that they're so ferocious looking and so scary that they can't even look at him. They're too scary. That the like the whatever their familiar spirit, whatever their spirit they're inhabited by, uh, won't allow them to look at it because it'll you know harm them. Or, these two traumatic event, yeah. And the girl said that they, they they drank black widow spiders. They drink them like every day. They make some concoction with a black widow spider and whatever else they put in there, and they drink it. It's crazy, but I don't, might not be that crazy. I mean, I don't know really know much about it to say that it's crazy. I mean, don't forget, you know, it might not, you know, just might not really mean uh or whatever how they said it's made it could have been like just a something that they tell people that's in there that's not really what's in there you know who knows but um yeah man i'm really okay i'm getting off the track here okay so uh <clears throat> okay where was I? Okay, different Jesus, Jesus, blah, blah, blah. Different kind of gospel, or a different kind of gospel than the one you believe. Okay, that'll be like uh, a Satanist person going inside a Catholic church and talking to the people and say, yeah, I'm a Satanist. And, uh, how many people in that church are gonna ex really accept what that person says? I mean, the people will probably be so, as soon as the person says I'm a Satanist, they'd probably be so scared, they'd probably all run away. If people are scared of you know that name just the word just people are just programmed you know once they hear that word they shut down <laughs> oh, I can't hear. okay okay let's, let's move on here okay now here's another part 
After all, you think you are so wise, but enjoy putting up with fools. You put up with it when someone enslaves you, taking everything you have, takes advantage of you, takes control of everything, and slaps you in the face. I'm ashamed to say that we've been too weak to do that. You know, that's funny because I said uh, the other, I was reading the scripture the other day, and I, I said that, yeah, we are fools. I said that. We are fools. Because we let the wolves around us, you know. And now I said it here. See, that's confirmation, right? That's, that could be considered like a cool event, you know, because I'm talking about scripture before I read it, you know, but I've read it before, so don't, you know, you know it's still in the back of my mind, you know, so... You know, that's part of it, too. Okay. Okay, this is good. I know I sound like a madman, but I have served him far more. I have worked harder, been put in prison more often, been whipped times without number, and faced death again and again. Five different times, the Jewish leaders gave me 39 lashes. Three times, I was beaten with rods. Once, I was stoned. Three times, I was shipwrecked. Once, I spent a whole night... In a day of drift at sea, I have traveled on many long journeys. I have faced danger from rivers. <coughs> <coughs> Robbers. Yeah, I gotta get something to drink here. Okay, I got. I got a. Could I have a V8? <laughs> oh, I did have a V8. I got a motel for a couple of days, you know. Fucking little refuge in a storm. Okay. I'm trying to move it along here, I know. So I don't exactly move like uh, lightning sometimes. Okay, I'm a little tired, right? Bear with me, all right? Please. I'm trying to do my best here. Okay. Good. Yeah, that was good. Okay. We're with, uh... I faced danger from men who claim to be believers but are not. I've worked hard and long. And during... See, they changed that. It was long and hard. They changed it hard and long. That's where long. That's where hard, uh, long and hard came from too. That's another little saying. Saying, see, now I, I show you two sayings that we use came from here. This one, that one. Okay. And during many sleepless nights, I've been hungry and thirsty. Okay, that's cr you know, cry baby, you know, or crying the blues, Ooh, you know, basically there, crying the blues there. But the best part is here. And besides all this, I have the daily burn of my concern for all the churches. Who is weak without my feeling that weakness? And who was led astray and I that I that that I do not burn with anger? You know? That's you know, all the watcher people they look at all the horrible things, you know. Why are these people, you know, it's innocent people getting wiped out, you know. And it's because they're Gentiles, you know. But the world doesn't know really what probably they didn't know what a Gentile is. All right. Let's get back to business here. Okay, and all those numbers too, that's the secret, you know, secret shit, you know, whatever it is. I don't really care. Oh yeah, that's all. The, anytime there's a number in here, that's oh. But there's watch. I'm, I I made some other correlations, other books in here too. It's coming up. Hold up. Hold up real quick. Just give me a chance. Okay. All right. When I was in Damascus, the governor under King Aretas kept guards at the city gates to catch me. I had to be lowered in a basket through a window in the city wall to escape from him. Remember? Lowered into the, the, a wall? How do you get lowered into a wall? A wall's like this. You can't get lowered into a wall. That's why I said, remember that was in the other book. Okay, there's a correlation to the other book. What we are reading. All right. One of the other books I was reading. 
Okay, here's a, a Satan scorch. Here's a scorching, scorching me. You know, might as well read it. Here, they, I'll give them a little scorching and let them get a little scorch on me here. Uh, but there's a good lesson in here too. Okay, even even though I have received such wonderful revelations from God, so to keep me from becoming proud, I was given a thorn in my flesh, a messenger from Satan to torment me and keep me from becoming proud. Okay, I'm making me look like the bad guy there. Three different times I begged the Lord to take it away. Each time he said, my grace is all you need. My power works best in weakness. So now I'm glad to boast about my weakness so that the power of Christ can work through me. That's why I take pleasure in my weaknesses and in the insults, hardships, persecution, and chose that I suffer for Christ. For when I am weak, then I am strong. Okay? That's not how it went. I, I rectified that one too in one of the videos. All these, the good ones I picked out, I, I rectified them. Yeah. That'd be a good way for someone to find faith in me, you know, too. Like, a, like even the Jesuits, anyway. Oh, shit. Maybe even that, you know. Seven generations, that's a long time. Since some of our creator allies, they might not have been here since then. I'm telling you, the Waymakers, they don't come, you know. They only, they don't come here that much. Baylon, don't come here that much. They, I don't believe. They're from, you know, they got other people to worry about. You know? Okay, all right, so I got a lot of stuff here. Where was I? Okay, I read all that. Everything we do, dear friends, is to strengthen you. For I, I am afraid that when I come, I won't like what I find. And you won't like my response. I'm afraid that I will find quarreling, jealousy, anger, selfishness, slander, gossip, arrogance, and disorderly behavior. Yes, I am afraid that when I come again, God will humble me in your presence. And I will be grieved because many of you have not given up your old sins. You have not repented of your impurity, sexual immorality, and eagerness for lustful pleasure. Well, I would say that would ring true if those people are really kidnapping those kids and raping them and stuff. Those my lab people. If those people are really doing that shit, man. I mean, I don't, that, that is just outrageous, man. The third time I am coming to visit you, and as scriptures say, the facts of every case must be established by the testimony of two or three witnesses. I have already warned those who had been sinning when I was there on my second visit. Now again I warn them and all others, just as I did before, that next time I will not spare them. Okay, talking about hybrid races there. So maybe those are, maybe uh, it's true that maybe there is an old race of Jew people. Like those people are, maybe those people were originally encompassed within a covenant. I mean, anything's possible. And then they created the, the hybrid race to go over there and fucking <clears throat> destroy their fucking name and make them look like the fucking villain. You know, scapegoat. Even the Jews a scapegoat. If that's true, that they are old race that was encompassed originally within a covenant, and they created some higher race to go over there and fucking desecrate their fucking reputation and everything, uh, that's fucked up. You know, that's fucked up. And if that's the case, I'm quite sure that the higher spiritual authorities are quite aware of that. And, uh, you know, like I said, you know, other than developing a clone detector, a reptoid detector, so you know if you're talking to a person or a lizard person or a whatever kind of person you're talking to, you know, you should have some kind of detector device. Like, you know, maybe, <clears throat> maybe, uh, 
we could check back in Spock's records, you know, find out how to build one. <laughs> Old Leonard Nimoy, man, that's my boy, man. I don't care what he did. They tried it. I don't know. They couldn't even really find too much bad to say about the guy. They tried to discredit him. And, and they showed a picture of like a whole bunch of fat ladies running up the stairs or something. <laughs> in his house. They say they they said that he used to have a lot of fat ladies, naked fat ladies running around the house. <laughs> and Search Up was the bomb, though. And Search Up was a great show, man. Fantastic. That was the beginning of our awareness right there, man. Honestly, I saw that show. Man. Okay, let's finish this up. Um, okay, two or three witnesses. Hello, come on back to Jamaica. Two or three witnesses, y'all. Who's the two or three witnesses? Well, I could think of quite a few worthy candidates. Double seven, Kafka, could be a woman just as much as a man. I will, I will quite surely say, you know, could be truth aggregated, Manny. Hey, these are all worthy witnesses, man. I believe. And we have Grindall, who doesn't like me anymore. Uh, Angela Brophy. We have so many people doing such great work. I mean, oh my God. It's just amazing. It's just astounding. I mean, if, you know, you could take somebody. Let's take my mother, for example. If I took my mother and tied her to a chair and forced her to look at the videos that I post on my page, her whole psyche would just crumble. She just, she would just, or any person, any regular person, not just my mother, you know, any regular person that just goes along in life, you know, dum dum dum. Which way did he go? Which way did he go? I'm not being arrogant, because I just woke up like 15 years ago. For that, sleepwalking. Everyone else. Just, uh, yeah, it's if someone was forced to look at the videos and all the posts and everything, their their whole psyche would crumble, just disintegrate. They would just they would disintegrate because the information would be so uh, annihilating to their world that I they they would probably just. All they'd be able to do after that would just be like walk around, and mumble, you know, drool. Yo, some people in for a rude awakening, boy. That's all I gotta say. And then I can't believe the people can't see the planets. I mean, oh my, the whole sky is blue and pink and red and fucking. You got two sunsets going on. The people don't even notice. Don't, don't even notice. You got a sun over there, a sun over there. But people just go through, you know, dun dun dun. dun. What's that? I don't know. It must be a sunbeam that traveled, you know, around the other side of the earth or something. It came out over there. I mean. <laughs> We're almost done. Okay. We pray to God that you will not do what is wrong by refusing our correction. I hope we won't need to demonstrate our authority when we arrive. Do the right thing before we come, even if that makes it look like we have, if it makes it look like we have failed to demonstrate our authority, for we cannot oppose the truth, but must always stand for the truth. We are glad to seem weak if it helps show that you are actually strong. We pray that you will become mature. <laughs> Okay, that's an ally talking there. That's an ally. That's a, definitely an ally. <clears throat> Person, figure, voice, whatever. 
I am writing this to you before I come, hoping that I won't need to deal severely with you when I do come, for I want to use the authority the Lord has given me and strengthen you, not to, not to tear you down. That's it, boys and girls, devotees and watchers, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, Galatians 3? That is another Galatian part. Okay, well, that's it. That's final, final 2. Galatians 2 final. I was watching a video where I said, yeah, we're gonna and what I said, I said, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna do Colossians next. <laughs> the way I said it was so funny because you know in jail they give you this shit called Colossus. And it's like a giant, you know, kielbasa hot dog. And they call it a Colossus. Colossus. <laughs> And, and you know we're in there and people say yeah what you what's for lunch man what they got for child you know? oh colossus <laughs> oh shit no time for jokes man no poor tribes man you know went somewhere and to go rescue the palestinian people and get them out of there man or the yemenis people i can't believe there's not one person in the world that could help these people are you fucking serious Psh, crazy man crazy ridiculous ridiculous all right y'all saw love we're all the brave too you know we stand be good talk to you again soon we'll do galatians 3 next all right galatians 3 coming up Salam.